news, my lovely, wonderful people. Not be smart in the happen. So, our very own brother, uh, Godwin Emefili, have said the new Naira note that people are crying that they are not getting. He said the new Naira note was meant for the masses, but they are being given to noble men by banks and they go to club to spray. So, so guys are going to club to spray this money. Why Nigerians, you know, are looking for money? Why Nigerians cannot get access to it? He said a small few neighbor group uh doing whatever they are doing for themselves they collect this money then they go to party to show you want to roll with the big boys or they go there to do a fugao or a hair all those are our our songs now so that's what they go there to do so the truth of the matter is at the end of the day some people have it in abundance and they are doing big boys with it while some people are suffering and are wondering what next how do we come out of this suffering? How do we, you know, elevate ourselves and get this suffering out of the way? So there are all kinds of words being, you know, being paraded out there. And it is high time that we look at these things carefully and understand, you know, where these things are at and what we could do differently to ensure that at the end of the day, Nigeria becomes a better place, not just for one, but for all. So it's about time we begin to consider these things more carefully and ensure that at the end of the day, the truth is being dispensed every time. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like or share, subscribe. The new Naira notes meant for the masses are being given by nobles to noble men by the banks to spray in clubs. Recall that the instruction earlier revealed, released by the Central Bank of Nigeria, that the old Naira note will stop being illegal tender on the 31st of January 2023 was later extended till February the 10th due to the ugly experience witnessed by many Nigerians in the bid to get the new Naira notes. This has come and has made the people go through very difficult times in recent days and age. However, the governor of Central Bank of Nigeria, Gordon Enefeli, has blamed Nigerians' banks for the scarcity of the Naira notes, saying they, are, they made adequate preparation for these very Naira notes. It was also gathered. According to the Nation's News report, that Godwin Emefili disclosed this yesterday when he appeared before the House of Representatives Abdul Community on the new Naira redesign, where he said, that is it not those in government and those in leadership some of the that some of the banks notes have have compared bankers to that and direct, giving directives for them to be to load the new notes onto their automatic teller machines this mo mo money has been given to noble men and others instead of being loaded into the uh, into the atms automatic teller machine by the way that's a full uh, approbation that's a full uh, pronunciation for the atm okay he said is it not this uh, people he said according to one of the his statements godwin emefili also said that the new notes meant for the masses have been given to nobles those who have money to spray in clubs and hotels why nigerians really needed this naira notes to be able to come out of the current difficult times that we are going through However, in a bid to cop this menac, anti grief agency has been sent after hearing about what bank officials are doing. They give them money and they give them all the notes available in their banks to these people instead of ensuring that Nigerians were given these notes and everyone have access to the new currency. So this is what is happening. Gordon Emefili, who was um, with the people, said... The bank notes is not going around like it should because some persons have taken upon themselves the bank notes because he appeared before the house, you see. The house was very angry with him and they said, Godwin, Godwin, come here, come here. Godwin, you, come here. What are you doing with the bank notes? What's going on with this whole bank note thing? He said, where? Uh, there was a, he said enough notes. You, 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 didn't, you didn't do any enough notes. If you had done enough notes, there'll be a lot in circulation. Do you know how much they used to produce this new? It's more than the amount of the banknotes. If the banknote is 200 naira, 
they spent more than 200 naira to produce a 200 naira note so how did it so how did it happen so how did it happen so when you look at the whole thing you can see for yourself okay you can see for yourself that there is serious call for concern the same people who are supposed to be looking after the people are falling out with other activities and doing things that are not convenient so it is a matter of urgent attention and nobody as a matter of concern must keep quiet and allow these same people to carry out their evil activities Gordon a mefeli who you know if you know you are redesigning something you must think it through and ensure that your eyes are dotted your t's are crossed it does not infringe pain and suffering hardship on the people however i don't think all these parts okay we are considered adequately in order for you know for this kind of situation to be taken care of as it should people are genuinely suffering a particular woman was on the bank half naked saying her children have not gone to school for two days there's no food at home she can't buy things because there's no cash in her hand that she doesn't want to bank again she just wants her money to be given back to her now what's going on with that woman you can describe it as frustration yes you can describe it as frustration why she needed more she needed more the system has failed her these are supposed to be people who should be telling us the truth okay so this is terrible this is terrible people who should be speaking are not speaking like they should so mefeli was with uh, the senate you know he has been trying to prevent or trying not to go there he was with them and he says well the issue here is that by this time you know in a few couple of months that there'll be enough but before that time people would have some people would don't die bad things for don't happen could we have prevented this yes what are we doing to prevent it do i say we're doing enough i don't think so because those in the arms of affair and this is why we must not choose a wrong leader again you heard me because a wrong leader we appoint people into offices and see the way they are working see their work ethics People that cannot be diligent enough to think it through and to ensure that everything that is needed to make a matter work has been duly considered and that is being implemented and put in place adequately. So at the end of the day, all systems and all the things are working like they should. So who is deceiving who? Leave us a comment. Bye for now.